Today was anything but merry for many people trying to make their way home from Christmas at Philadelphia International Airport. Across the country, more than 6,000 flights were canceled this weekend as many airline workers were quarantined for COVID-19. Eyewitness News reporter Alicia Roberts is live at the airport where travelers are stuck and out of luck. Alicia. Yeah, you can say that again, Alicia. Good evening to you. Today is expected to be the third busiest travel day all throughout the year. Many we talk to say, hey, they learned their lesson about traveling for the holidays. Every uh, flight is like booked. Leaving was horrible. Whether you were traveling on two legs or four, Buddy is uh, seven weeks old. This Christmas weekend had a list of late. We uh, boarded probably about 45 minutes late. Three hours. Said it was because of the air traffic control. And worse yet, grounded flights at Philadelphia International Airport. We were already here through security, sitting, waiting at our gate. Nationwide, Flight Aware says Sunday alone, more than 4,000 flights were delayed, with another 1,000 canceled. Major carriers, including Delta and American, citing COVID staffing shortages as part of the issue. And passengers, too, felt the hassle of heightened protocols, like this couple vacationing in the Bahamas. Getting registered into another country, getting tested before you left. We got tested again this morning. It's sad. It's really sad. For the Savitsky family, a canceled spirit flight means no go for son Mitchell to meet up with his dance team in LA after three years of virtual practices during the pandemic. I can't give him my money back, and um, they have no flights out until Tuesday, and that's halfway through the trip. Many we talk to say the headaches will make them think twice about planning a holiday trip for next year. Stay home. Wait till all of this is over. I will never do it again. And experts predict tomorrow, Monday, will also be one of the busiest travel days of the year, combining both business and holiday travelers. Experts urge you to plan ahead and leave extra time if you are heading to the airport. Reporting live at PHL, Alicia Roberts, CBS3 Eyewitness News.